weekend, is it? Yes. We don't guess at anything. We know what these uh -huh. are, right? Okay. Come What's on. going to happen this weekend? Well, it's going to be a typical summer weekend with plenty of sunshine, but a lot of afternoon thunder showers. And that's summer. You have to expect that sort of thing. And we've got partly cloudy skies in Atlanta right now. And our temperature is all the way up to 81 degrees. Relative humidity, 51%. Wind is out of the northwest at 7 miles per hour. Barometer is 30.04. And it's been falling during the past few hours. And no rainfall anywhere in Atlanta since midnight last night. Yesterday's high was 83. Our low this morning at 63. And that gives us an average, which is exactly what it should be for that 24-hour period. And the pollution index for yesterday was 43. Our live action radar is sweeping around the southeast on the 250 mile range and it indicates no shower activity taking place anywhere, although later on this afternoon there may be a few isolated thunder showers popping up, particularly in the southern part of the state. Our satellite picture taken earlier this morning shows clear skies across the state and generally clear to partly cloudy weather from the lower plains all the way up to the middle Atlantic states. A few clouds and showers across South Florida and a large band of clouds with showers and heavy thunder showers embedded in that area. But these fair to partly cloudy skies should remain with us for at least the next few days. And we will see a gradual increase in the moisture content during the next two days. So our chances of showers and thunder showers popping up by Thursday will be fairly good. Right now we've got a ridge of high pressure with the main center across the Alabama-Georgia border. But the ridge itself extends from the middle of the Gulf all the way up to the middle Atlantic states, producing generally fair to partly cloudy skies. Now the circulation around this high pressure system is beginning to advect a good flow of warm, wet air out of the Gulf of Mexico, clashing with much cooler and drier air across the northern plains. And so showers and thunder showers have broken out in a large area. There's a very well-developed squall line moving through the northern plains right now, producing locally heavy rain fall and some strong gusty winds but no reports of any severe weather there were four tornadoes across the country yesterday two of those were in Nebraska and the other two in South Dakota but no major damage or injuries came out of those storms this frontal system will move very slowly to the south and southeast moving into the Ohio Valley and lower plain states by late tomorrow night but our high pressure system is expected to remain pretty much in the same position although it will drift a little further to the east and give us a little better flow out of the southwest increasing our moisture content just a little bit. The weather forecast for Atlanta vicinity for today it will be partly cloudy and warm with a high of 85. For tonight, fair and mild with a low of 64. For Thursday, partly cloudy and warm with a chance of an afternoon thunder shower and a high of 86. For the Thursday night, fair and mild and a low of 67. Probability of showers is 30% on Thursday. The weather outlook for Friday through Sunday, partly cloudy and continued warm through the period with scattered afternoon and evening thunder showers, most likely on Friday, but the weekend is looking good. Great, Dennis. Thanks very much.